Let's, let me show you how Google can help you secure some of your most sensitive data. Most companies today have a policy around data minimization. The goal being to minimize the amount of data that you collect and store to only the data that's actually needed to run your business. But that's easy to do in, in words, but hard to do in practice. Data has a way of leaking out all over the place. So let's look at a concrete example. We have an enterprise application that a support agent might use to chat with your end users. And in the chat, you can see Neil's a support agent, and he's asked Alice for some information to verify her account. Well, Alice has way overshared. We just wanted the last four of her social. She gave us her full social, her phone number, and a picture of her social security card. <laughs> now, obviously, we want to store this chat, right, to see whether uh, how our conversations are going or how the agents are working. But like, I can't store that in a database. I'm going to have half my company now knowing Alice's social security number. So how do we do that? DLP makes it easy. When he ends the chat, we will use data loss prevention to identify and redact sensitive information. So now you'll see that we've, yes. We recognize over 40 different types of sensitive info types. In this case, we've identified Alice's name. If he scrolls down a little bit, you can see we found her phone number, her social security number. We replaced all those with red dots. And even we went into the picture of the social security card, found the social security number there, and redacted it. Now this chat can be used for analysis. Now, just to prove this is real, Neil has a webcam over there, and we're going to try one more example. You know, I was in the green room a while ago, and I found this credit card sitting there, and it said Urs Holzler. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Neil has a sample credit card with a valid number, but it's not Urs's card. I trust DLP. I don't trust 10,000 of you with cell phone cameras. <laughs> so he's going to put the credit card number on it. He's going to hit the button. We're going to use DLP, and it will uh, find and redact the credit card. Now. This isn't just dumb OCR. You'll notice it didn't blot out the, the expiration date or the name because we told the API that the only information we wanted to eliminate was credit card numbers. So you can uh, control the, your definition of PII, what matters to you. So there you have it, identity or a proxy. We made it super simple to take a corporate application and make it available to our end users without the hassle of complex network configurations. And with data loss prevention, we were able to help it make sure that you minimize the amount of data that you collect so that's one less headache you have in terms of compliance or regulatory or really just running your business.